everyone nowadays is a youtuber and making money in youtube is one of the easiest ways you can but it is not as easy as it say, as i'm saying because when it comes to youtube there are some things that you should you should, ha you should have met so that you can start now monetizing your youtube channel and we had talked in another video on things you need to do when you're starting a youtube channel and how do you really monetize your youtube channel and we saw that when you want to monetize your youtube channel you need to have at least 1000 subscribers and 4000 watch watch time hours on or if you're maybe dealing with shots you need 10 million views in in in, in youtube shots and you also need to maybe have met the community guidelines so we need that is how you monetize your youtube channel and if you want more insights on how to really monetize your youtube channel and the things you need when starting a youtube channel we have done videos go and check them out we have done a very very detailed uh, explanation on that but today i want actually to talk to anyone who has already ventured into youtube uh, YouTube uh, as a source of maybe revenue or a source of income or maybe they are just doing it as a hobby so there are some things you should never do as a youtuber so what are the things that you should not do as a youtuber one of the things you should never do as a youtuber is violate youtube community guidelines and when you violate community guidelines that means you are not even able to monetize your 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 your, your, your youtube channel what are some of these community guidelines one of them is things like copyright have you taken content that is not yours and now started claiming it as your as your content? You know when you have used someone else's music, when maybe you 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 are what whatever your content you're making, maybe you, it was supposed to fall in the kids category, but maybe you did not put in the kids category, or maybe the content that you're saying is in, supposed to be in kids category is adult content and you have put it in the kid category so you find that these are, these are the community guidelines you should follow there's there's a list of community guidelines that have been set by youtube that you're supposed to follow and if you're a youtuber you should not violate these rules otherwise you find that your your account is suspended you're not even monetizing your youtube account and you're losing a lot because you have invested money or maybe you invested time and resources to start that youtube channel another thing you should not do as a youtube as a youtuber is buy fake views because once you buy fake views you will not get to you will not be able to monetize your account because there is an algorithm that youtube uses to identify how many views have you got and they can be able to know if these are fake views you have bought you know most people buy fake views so that they can please uh, people and, and and because they want people to subscribe to their YouTube channel and they tell you I already have 20,000 views just subscribe you see they, maybe they want they're doing it for clout so don't buy if, if you are a youtuber and you want to be successful in the YouTube uh, in making money in YouTube don't buy don't buy fake views otherwise YouTube have has an algorithm that can know if this if you are if you are if your YouTube viewers they are legit or they are fake Another thing you should not do as a YouTuber is ignore or mistreat your audience because your audience plays a critical role in uh, making ma how how people will love you. You know, your audience is your community, and it's like your family in a way. And once you start mistreating this, mistreating your audience, you find that you're losing views, you're losing subscribers, and you find yourself you're going back to zero. And even if you, if you, and when you're talking about mistreating your, your, your audience, what do you mean? It's how you reply to them. How do you address them? You know, some, sometimes we forget as a YouTuber, you forget that once you, you, you're recording your video, there's someone who has sat down to watch you or to listen to you. So how do you address them? Are you rude to them? Do you disregard their, 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 their religion? Do you disregard their, their culture? You know, so, some of the things you should really be considerate when you're making a YouTube video. Be, be, know who is your audience and understand, understand their, their culture, understand their religion, understand the con content you're making for them. And even in the comment section, the way you reply to the comments will have a big impact on how ma how many people will return to view your to view your videos so if you are you view in the comment section you are rude you if, or maybe you don't even reply to them it is really good to reply to people in the comment section and people appreciate when they have a concern maybe about your video and you are able to address it 
many people disregard and the answer the answer the comments they feel like answering and they ignore other people and that and that person can see you have really ignored him so it is really good to respect your audience because your audience that that is the same person who will go and refer your video to another person tell them uh, there is this guy i watch on youtube you should check him out and that is how you gain another subscriber then that subscriber will go and recommend you to another and that is how you grow as as a, as a youtuber that is how you grow your views so that is how you grow your subscribers and that is how that is the only way you can actually monetize your youtube channel then another thing you should not do as a youtuber is neglect quality and consistency many people actually neglect quality and remember people are watching your videos if you put bad a video with no audio if you put video with bad sound bad lighting people will be bored and they start not subscribing they start not listening to you and that is how you find that sometimes you had 1000 subscribers and the next week or the next day you find that you have only 500 subscribers and you wonder why did they, where did all these people go it's because of the quality you ignored quality you are shooting you are shooting your 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 videos in a badly lit place there is no sound the sound quality is bad it has noises you know you should really be considerate about the type of type of quality the quality of your video and also you should also be consistent because there is you have already created an anticipation on with with uh, your audience are already anticipating for your next video so if i if i put content today then the next one i put it next month the next one i put it after two years they will forget about you and one thing about your audience you have to remind them that you exist you have to keep them ad updated and that is why we tell people if you if, you, if at least post three times a, a week that way you 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 can your your, your audience will know that you do exist they will remember you and they will now be anticipating for more videos from you so it is really good to be consistent do not post today then the next one you post three weeks later then the next one you post one year later you the way you can grow your audience is by keeping them updated giving them more information that, that they have something to be relying on you know and they will be interested to know oh today he put this video what will he put tomorrow so you see they are eager to know what you're, what are you going to be posting tomorrow then the other thing you should not do as a youtuber and this is something that happens to many people is give up many people who have started youtube channel they give up and why do they give up because maybe they wanted to they think that once you start a youtube channel it will grow within one week and half you'll have like 100,000 subscribers no it doesn't work like that you have to be patient one thing about youtube one thing i have learned about youtube is that you have to be patient patient you have to be patient because the subscribers they are it's gradual it's something that is gradual it doesn't grow overnight it doesn't grow within one week you have to keep posting and that is why i'm emphasizing on consistency the more you post the more people notice your video the more you gain subscribers the more you gain views the more the more now you grow so you should really be patient and don't give up and st and one thing you should do as a youtube business is always start if you feel like you're a new if you feel you're a youtuber one of the biggest challenges that many youtubers face is starting so just start even though it start you will start with your phone just start that is one of the easiest way to start growing is just by just starting because many people get stuck because they feel like i need to have lighting i need to have a good camera no just start with whatever you have the resources that you have so those are the the five things you should never do as a youtuber we have talked about how to start a youtube channel how to monetize your youtube channel and all things how to grow your youtube channel you have done videos on that if you want to learn more about youtube uh, uh making the channel that is in terms of making the channel growing your channels everything related with, with with youtube you can check out our other videos we have given uh, we have given a detailed information on that on the same and uh, if you want to learn about youtube uh, monetization youtube marketing you can enroll at finstock university college and they have short courses at a very affordable fee you can visit their website at www.finstockuniversity.com or call their customer care service at 0703-313-722 or send them an email at info at finstockuniversity.com 
Thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure at the end of this video you like, comment, subscribe, share, and hit on the notification button so that every time I upload a new video, you can be notified. It is until next time. Goodbye.